Hello everyone, welcome to Chemicals Academy. So we already discussed about oxidation of alcohols, mainly important oxidizing agents. So now it's time to talk about reducing agents. What are the important reducing agents? How they are reduced? Which type of compounds are reduced by these reducing agents? So in this video, uh, we are talking about the first main two important reducing agents that is lithium aluminum hydrate and sodium borohydrate. Lithium aluminum hydrate and sodium borohydrate have almost same applications, uh, but they are a uh, little bit different. Uh, when comparing these two reagents, sodium borohydrate is more useful because it is more chemoselective. We can see how these two differ and how they reduce compounds. Which type of compounds are reduced by these reagents? First of all, uh, the main similarities are the both uh, nucleophilic in nature. Both reagents are nucleophilic in nature. Nucleophilic means nucleus loving, positive loving species. And they attack polarized multiple bonds, C double bond or C triple bond type. Lithium aluminum hydrate and sodium borohydrate attack polarized double bonds, multiple bonds, CO and CN. Cyanide and the carbonic groups are reduced to using these reagents. And another is, in, this is important application that is it does not reduce isolated double bond and triple bonded carbon. C double bond and C triple bond C are not reduced when lithium aluminum hydrate and sodium borohydrate are used. Important is isolated. Isolated double bond and triple bond are not reduced when these reagents are used. Now how they differ? Uh, we can see that. Okay, now uh, lithium aluminum hydride. What is lithium aluminum hydride? And how, what type of compounds are reduced by lithium aluminum hydride? Lithium aluminum hydride first uh, forms Li plus and AlH4 minus, then AlH3 plus H minus. We don't want to uh, study the mechanism, but you should have an idea that the H minus in LiAlH4, lithium aluminum hydride, the H minus is the uh, plays the main role in reducing the compounds. So in one LiAlH4, lithium aluminum hydride, four H minus is available. So it can reduce four times a compound. So the main concept is. H minus in lithium aluminum hybrid is the uh, main role which plays main role in reducing agents, reducing compounds. So which type of compounds are reduced by lithium aluminum hybrid? First of all aldehydes, aldehydes, ketones, amides, esters, acids etc. Aldehyde is RCH2 is reduced to alcohol RCH2OH. R2C double bond, which is a ketone, is reduced to alcohol. Aldehyde is reduced to primary alcohol. Primary alcohol and ketone is reduced to secondary alcohol. And RCO2 R dash ester, it is reduced to al uh, alcohol, a primary alcohol, and another alcohol. RCOOH acid is reduced to alcohol. RCONR2 dash amide is reduced to RCH2NR2. And RC triple bond ends. Cyanide group is reduced. reduced. RNO2 nitro group is reduced. So, lithium aluminum hydride can reduce many compounds. Uh, it is a powerful of reducing agent. Powerful reducing agent. Powerful reducing agent is lithium aluminum hydrate. Compared to sodium borohydrate. Sodium borohydrate cannot reduce uh, every compounds. It can reduce only aldehyde, aldehyde, ketone, and acid chloride. Acid chloride means what? RCOX. X can be halide.
chlorine bromine iodine so rcox acid chloride are reduced by sodium borohydride it cannot reduce ester acid amide uh, cyanide group etc so not cyanide pentyl groups so uh, when comparing to lithium aluminium hydride and sodium borohydride lithium aluminium hydride is more powerful reducing agent than sodium borohydride so when in laboratories we use sodium borohydride because if we want a particular uh, compound a selective reduction if we want selective reduction we use only sodium borohydride instead of lithium aluminium hydride because lithium aluminium hydride is a powerful reducing agent and it can reduce many compounds so it's not a uh, preferred so sodium borohydride is more chemoselective chemoselective means reducing or attacking a particular functional group so sodium borohydride is more useful than lithium aluminium hydride lithium aluminium hydride can reduce aldehyde ketone ester acid amide acid chloride also cyanide nitro etc so uh, we can see the examples so let's see examples first example uh, to this compound when lithium aluminium hydride is added uh, which group will be reduced aldehyde group is present so aldehyde group is converted to reduced to alcohol so this group can be reduced to alcohol CHO is converted to CH2OH so this CHO is converted to alcohol or primary alcohol and in second example which group can be reduced COOH acid group is reduced by lithium aluminium hydride to alcohol so acid COOH is converted to alcohol and next example here two types of uh, conditions is uh, given first 35 degrees Celsius and the second condition is low temperature minus 10 degrees Celsius so in uh, first condition 35 degrees Celsius or a high temperature this double bond is reduced at low temperature the double bond is not reduced so in first condition the double bond is reduced and CHO is reduced to aldehyde sorry alcohol CHO is reduced to alcohol and also the double bond is reduced in 35 degrees Celsius in low temperature the double bond remains same and CHO is converted to alcohol CH2OH double bond remains same in low temperature so when a beta array alpha beta unsaturated carbonic compound is given and at the high temperature the double bond is reduced and at the low temperature the double bond remains same and in fourth example uh, two reagents is given NaBH4 and lithium aluminium hydride when sodium borohydride is added what happens sodium borohydride is chemoselective it reduces only aldehyde ketone acid chloride so here a ketone is there and the ester group is there so sodium borohydride does not reduce ester group but lithium aluminium hydride can reduce ester group so the first product is this double bond over is reduced to OH and CO2 ET remains as it is and lithium aluminium hydride added what happens first an alcohol form and ester is reduced to another alcohol CH2H so sodium borohydride can reduce uh, cannot reduce ester group it only reduces the ketone and lithium aluminium hydride is reduced to uh, ester group also that's the difference between sodium boro and lithium aluminium hydride when we study about sodium borohydride, uh, we should remember another reagent that is Luce reagent. Luce reagent. Luce reagent is sodium borohydride in presence of 
cerium chloride. Cerium chloride. Cerium is in plus 3 oxidation state. Cerium, a lanthanide. So, in presence of cerium chloride, sodium borohydride attack or reduce uh, in a different manner. How? Sodium borohydride in presence of cerium chloride that is known as Luce reagent. In presence of this compound or Luce reagent, sodium borohydride reduces a aldehyde or a ketone uh, with 1 2 attack. That means Luce reagent attack alpha, beta, unsaturated ketones in a manner that an allylic alcohol is formed. Allylic. Allylic alcohol is formed through 1, 2 attack. That means the double bond, the bo double bond is not affected in uh, presence of Luce reagent. So Luce reagent is sodium borohydride in presence of Cerium chloride. Cerium chloride. So alpha, beta, unsaturated ketones are attacked. Selectively reduces less reactive group. Luce reagent selectively reduces less reactive group. So ketone is less reactive than aldehyde. Ketone is less reactive than aldehyde. So Luce reagent will reduce ketone first. If ketone and aldehyde is present, when we use Luce reagent, Ketone is reduced in, uh, instead of aldehyde. So less reactive group is reduced by Luce reagent and double bond is not affected. That is allylic alcohol is formed. 1, 2 attack. Not 1, 4 attack. Only 1, 2 attack is um, uh, done through Luce reagent. And the example is uh, when to this compound MABH4 MAOH. Without cerium chloride is given, uh, it reduces, it gives two compounds that is the double bond allylic and the non allylic. So 59 percentage is allylic and 41 percentage non allylic. But when we use cerium chloride, Luce reagent, 99 percentage of product is allylic, 99 percentage of compound is 1 to attack. 1, 2 attack. Here 1, 4 attack is uh, attack the compound is formed. So when we use the Luce reagent, only 1, 2 attack is formed. Allylic alcohol is formed uh, in presence of cerium chloride NaBH4. So that's Luce reagent. Okay, let's do some more examples. In first example, CH2 and the ketone is there. So we know in presence of Luce reagent, less reactive group is reduced, less reactive group is ketone. So this double bond O is converted to OH, uh, alcohol. And aldehyde is not affected. CHO. Okay, this double bond is not affected because Luce reagent is present. 1, 2 addition is done. So, the bond O is converted to OH. And in second example also, uh, ketone is there, CHO, aldehyde. Only ketone is reduced to OH. Rest of the compound remains same. CHO. And third example, uh, CHO double bond O. So, double bond O is reduced to OH. Ketone is reduced. Me. O H C H O is remain as it is. In fourth example, a ester group is there and a ketone group. We know sodium borohydride cannot reduce ester group. So only this ketone is reduced to alcohol. Here, H minus plays the main role in reduction. 
So H minus comes in a direction where less hindered group is less hindered, less uh, bulky group is present. Here the less hindered side is N2. This side N2. So in a bicyclic combo, in a bicyclic combo, this position is XO and this position is N2. From this position it is called N2 and this is XO. So when a hindered uh, or bulky group is present, the incoming group H minus will come to N2 position. So here H and here OH. H minus is incoming group. So H will come through N2 position. And here it is H and OH. This is the stereochemistry of this compound. So sodium borohydride reduces uh, aldehyde, ketone, acid chloride. Lithium aluminum can reduce aldehyde, ketone, acid, uh, chloride, acid, amide, cyanide, nitro, uh, almost every compound. So that's the main difference between sodium borohydride and lithium aluminium hydride. And another uh, point is Luce reagent. Luce reagent is sodium borohydride in presence of cerium chloride. When cerium chloride is present, Luce reagent is given. One to attack is uh, possible. Uh, one four is eliminated. One four attack is not uh, usually occurred. Allylic alcohol is formed and less reactive group is affected attack that is ketone if we uh, if we have ketone and aldehyde ketone is attacked when Luce reagent is given so that's the uh, points about sodium borohydride and lithium aluminium lithium aluminium hydride